On today's episode of Taffy's an Idiot, you're gonna see me recreate this. Oh, gorgeous. Oh, yes. Let's look here. You know what I'm gonna recreate it with? This. This. I was down at Posty Plus the other day purchasing some new $25 skinny jeans. Oh, yeah! Jeans! Uh, while I was there, I happened to spy with my little eye their bargain makeup section. And what did I spy in that bargain makeup section? W7's delicious palette. Delicious. Natural and berry. Eye color palette. It fucking... Oh. Look at this shit. Look at this shit! Look familiar? If you're a makeup nerd, then you'll know that it is 100% the most dedicated, incredible ripoff of the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance palette. But, I mean, it's exactly the same. Exactly the same. They didn't bother putting names on the colours because, uh, it's trash. Right, so this. Well, I spent $25 on the jeans. This is in New Zealand money, by the way, which in the real world is worth absolutely fuck all. So this, right, $10. I could not resist. Oh, I could not resist. That $10 New Zealand is like $7 US at the most. For all of this, there's so many colors. There's 14 colors! Wow! What a bargain! I hear you say. Yeah. Oh, and it also, it also came with a double-ended brush slash smudger, which, and that end. This end, though. Whoa! Yeah, kind of a pleasing, fluffy friend. Actually, this is the best part of the whole thing. And I'll tell you why. Because I thought, oh, wouldn't it be fun to do somebody else's eye look that they've done with like the real modern renaissance palette of course you plug it in first cut that comes up jeffree star yay big fan so this is me trying to recreate this using this it's been an experience my friends Good, good times. Before we get pretty, first, we've got to get Taffy ugly, right? Yeah. Let's get ugly! Wig snatched! Ah! Oof! <laughs> hey! Oh, mm, hello there. Hello! Oh, look. Oh! Beauty personified, am I right? Yes! Here we are. I've got, um, Big J on the TV behind me. And I'm gonna try and follow this. And it could go badly. Because, you know, what I have is not modern renaissance. It's delicious! Let's, I'm gonna press play and, um, see what this cunt has to say about you know, makeup and shit. We've primed. I could do more prime. No, I'm not going to do more prime. You only need, well, I mean, these pores, am I right? Mm. Aging is a bummer. Oh, okay, uh, loud music. Yeah, that's Jeffree Star looking pretty. Yeah, oh, mm, mm, mm. Mm. oh, it's so beautiful. Right. What's up, everyone? Welcome to my channel. If you're new, hi, Jeffrey. I recently got in that crazy car accident. It was a total loss, and it was all paid for. <laughs> I wasn't expecting so, this. You know, I could have died a few weeks ago, so I was like having a realization, like, you my know, death that, comes like, for all of us. I it's coming for you, Barbara. Night, and I walked into that Lamborghini dealership, and I said, "Hi, my name is Miss Star." And I would like one. So of I course you fucking best, did. But the most gorgeous thing I've ever seen. That shit's so yellow. Hobbies and things that I love or makeup. Cannot or relate. So I, mean, okay. I am just one guy in makeup that started I mean, out with just hopes and dreams. And I mean, you started out with uh, 10 million MySpace followers. 
Go after your dreams. Stop living for Fine! I fucking will! I'm going after my dreams, Jay! You're doing because I am going after my dreams. I think that I am more motivated than ever to just slay, so I'm excited okay. to uh, be back, you guys. So what are we I'm motivated today? to slay as well. Let's go! Anastasia's Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Eyeshadow Palette. Is Five dollars. Smoky dark eye. Lashes up to heaven. When I did my $200 Oh, ah! All right, let's get to shaking. He's got nice foundation. I've got Maybelline. Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's clinical depression. And then I guess we, uh... All over the forehead, cover up my two weird patches. Got a weird patch there, and I got a weird patch up there. And for some reason, they're a weird dark, <laughs> darker brown with like freckles in them. And I don't know why. Am I beautiful? Mm, I've seen worse. We're just gonna do one pump for that. It's quite a lot. It just, you know, really brightens and opens you up. So I'm gonna try this. Opens you up. Again, I'm gonna go in with Maybelline. Know why? Because they sell it at the supermarket. The White Friend by um, Makeup Revolution in C0. Flint. And add a little bit of this. Places. Where's that beauty blender gone? Alright, found it. Yeah, now let's blend this motherfucker in. Oh, does mug looking beat? We're going to coat the entire face with a powder foundation. I mean, I'm going to use Maybelline's Fit Me because then I got a pressure. <laughs> Uses something big and fluffy. I guess this looks kind of big and fluffy. Right. Uh, bitch. Come on. Why are you so. Okay, cool. That looks fit, I guess. All right, now I'm gonna take my Mac Shivering White Studio Fix and highlight these damn under eyes. Okay, so in all the white places, grabs another brush, something maybe a little bit firmer, I think. It's this guy. And I'm gonna use. Oh, I mean, I don't have I like a shivering white powder. Fuck. Where am I gonna get that? But instead, I'm gonna use. Oh, I'm a fucking, I am a shill for Maybelline. Oh, no. Not sponsored, by the way. Fuck me, this stuff is, oh, God. Blech. A pleasant and powdery finish. All right, fam. Moving right along. But I'm ready to get to contouring. Yeah, contour. Cap on each shade and light contour palette. Best formula right now on the market. I'm just gonna. I think I'm just gonna do something really kind of soft and subtle. My cheekbones are already. Right. Soft and subtle contouring. Don't have any Cap Von D shirt. What the fuck, fam? I do, however. Have this! Oh, a real eyeshadow palette! GG, Taffs! Old, uh, yoink, Safe Word McGee is actually quite a good colour for contouring for me because I'm pale and stuff. So I'm gonna do that. Light. Subtle. Okay. And, uh, Jawline as well, I guess. All right. Let's make it look slightly skinnier than it is. Boop. Jawline achieved. All right. Now, next. And then I'm 
then we're just gonna go back in with that first brush and just kind of diffuse it a little bit. Now we're gonna go back oh, with this color. And diffusing. We're do a little or a lot on that forehead. So I'm just gonna go in and really contour this forehead, honey. Like we're not gonna play around today. Now I do like to go back and forth. Oh, what? I'm supposed to contour my forehead. That's. I think that's a man thing, isn't it? Like, I. All these male beauty gurus are so... Oh, my hairline. Oh, it's huge. I don't know. Of all the things I hate about myself, forehead, very low down on the list. But what Big Daddy J says, Big Daddy J gets. Okay. Right, that's ridiculous. So I will definitely it into this lightest color and just kind of go over it make sure it's not too you know blotchy or weird and then we're gonna hit that chin a little bit and carve out this jawline right well i already done that now for highlighting i'm gonna be using Ooh, highlighting. New, honestly. right so he's going for proper highlighted by a, a proper brand of makeup i don't have like a standalone highlighter what the fuck you use a sparkly eyeshadow same shit man what I'm going to do, right, is hoover into my, um, delicious, grab out, right, this one, and there's this one here, right, it's sort of a pretty uh, shimmery, yeah, pinkish gold kind of moment. I'm gonna, the, the pans are very small, so I'm gonna try my best to just sort of hoover some of this onto my, oh, okay, I mean, I guess you're going on the brush everywhere else as well but um uh, let's see how this goes one doesn't want to get too close to the eyes because then it gets all up in your fucking eye wrinkles and then you're like and it's ugly because being old is ugly oh okay you know what i'm gonna try and do bit of this and then see if it sticks better ready Thanks, Maybelline. GG. Maybe I'll try and blend in a little bit of the, the sparkly gold that's just underneath it as well. Let's just do that. Oh. It's going everywhere but on the brush. Can't... Look, I mean, look, there's a little bit of something happening. I mean, uh, uh, she's not blinding. I don't think Big Daddy J would be impressed for this. I'm going in with my finger, mate. Oh. Oh. Finger works a lot better than fluffy brush. Who would have thought? Boink on the end of my nose. Boink, 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 boink. And then a little bit there powder all over my pants but yeah, there's a little bit of there's a <sighs> fuck it it'll do right let's see what happens next i'm gonna take a little bit on my chin and just shock you all and just do a little moment right there oh now, shocking i'm gonna leave my nose alone today and i'm not gonna surprise you all but i'm gonna really focus on the eyes cheeks and lips for this video so we're gonna oh we're not nose contouring Let's draw on some brows real quick off camera and I'll be right back. Oh, this bitch is doing his brows off camera. I ain't gonna pussy out and do them off camera. I'm gonna do them right here. Oh, sweet Jesus, take the wheel! Oh, okay. Sisters, not twins, right? Don't know what the fuck is up with this one at the moment. Thanks, I hate it. High school yearbook, right? Seventh form, lever. My profile, 
My friends decided to put under life goals, grow some eyebrows. Fuck you, bitches. They're never gonna grow back. So I have to draw them on. I am so excited to dip into the modern Renaissance palette. I wish you guys could feel this. If you don't own this, it feels like felt velvet. Like, fuck. Oh, I'm super excited to dip into this delicious palette. Um, this feels just like cardboard. Just shiny cardboard. The colors are so gorgeous. Tell me the colors are. Look at this like palette, you guys. They, uh, yes. they are. Ex Today, I'm kind of feeling really kind of dark, sultry, like pinky purple under. And then on the lid, sultry. I don't know what we're going to do yet. We're just going to wing it and see what happens. Okay. So I just want to. I said cognac instead of cognac in every comp. Oh. You think you're bougie, don't you? Let's dive in. So I think right off the bat, I see Primavera is so pretty. I'm like. Mm, you guys see that? I'm just gonna swatch it with my finger really. Primavera, right? This little goldie friend down here. Let me swatch it with my finger. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, uh, 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 well, uh, uh. Look at that. I'm this like, doesn't feel like butter. It feels like cheap. I now, should. usually I like to do a transition color first. I'm just going to go right in with this light one. And we're just going to go all in the lid with this guy because... Right. We are going all in the lid with this guy. Okay. Okay, friend. Let's... Oh, God. Oh, dear. Yeah, that's flying all over my house. Let's just try and... Oh, it's flying everywhere. Oh. I don't know, fam. Maybe if it was wet. You know what? Fuck it. I'll do that. All right, where's my setting spray? Spray the shit out of it. Try again. It's all over my cheeks. It's everywhere. Maybe I should have baked a little harder before I attempted this. Should have known it wasn't going to be good, dude. You should have known! I don't think it's going to get any better than that. Can you even? Mm. It's okay. It's it's okay. I'm like a bird. I just gravitate to it. I opened this palette and I was like, mm. The thing I love about the Anastasia formula is these shadows blend really quickly really easy and they show just right off the bat you don't have to put any extra work now real gar is this gorgeous like apricot orangey transition color and i'm just like oh yes get on my lids okay so old an orange mcgee here in the corner on a big fluffoon let's right so a fluffy brush and then now normally I take it all the way in. I'm actually gonna let that not happen today and change it up a bit and just kind of stop it there. Orange, right? I mean, oh, this one's better. Oh shit! <laughs> I always put it everywhere. Oh dear, Taffy, you know what you're doing, mate, don't you? And we don't go all the way. We just go a bit of the way. Yeah, all right, all right. Well, this orange shade has certainly got a lot more going for it than whatever the fuck that terrible gold was up to. Not a lot. Yeah, okay. Now what do we do? A little MAC blending brush. We're going to dip into burnt orange. So burnt orange is this guy down here, essentially. And we are going to blend this shade out. And I'm just going to add that right on top. Okay. So then we get a bigger fluffy. Let's see. Actually, you know what I am going to use for this? This palette. God bless it. Came with its own brush. So it's got a, a flat end, which just looks trash, to be honest. But it does have a fluffy end. And I reckon this could be a go. I mean, it's it's okay. O orangey, I guess. Oh, hello. Right, that's... Yep. 
right that's gone everywhere but uh so we blend up on the outside miggy help mommy you know what not that is shit i mean there's no point tapping the color off because then you won't be left with any so I'm just going to go in and be like, oh, I guess I'll clean up my face later on. Managed to make it terribly uneven. It's fine. All right, now to blend out the transition color, we're going to be using tempura. And I'm just going to blend and buff out what's going on here. Now, you know what's crazy, you guys? About okay, tempura. Oh, shit. Looks white on him. And here it's very, oh, eggshell, maybe. Right, let's get another fluffy. I guess it blend out. That, oh, hello. There's not a shit ton of pigment in it, but it, I mean, it's, I guess it's blending all right. Yeah, sure. We're gonna be using a little MAC 217. I'm gonna be dipping into Cypress Umber, and it is like this beautiful dark chocolate brown. What do they call it? Umber, burnt umber, whatever the fuck that is. Okay, and let's really cover this. Oh, okay, that's happening. In there, and then all the way down to the lash line. Do, do, do. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. This is going to be a struggle. Yeah, let's do something a little bit firmer. Perhaps. And Oh, dude, what is going on here? Mm, get in that right. <sighs> Wish me luck. It's all over my face. It's not on my eye, it's on my face. Okay, so he's. We're just really darken that eye. Now notice how I'm stopping it right there. I'm not bringing it. Right, so he's going the whole way out. To, I don't know if that's a good idea, fam. Okay. Okay, I thought the gold. This color is the worst. Okay, there we go. I, it looks like we've achieved a, a semblance of color. All right, let's struggle on to the next one, dude. I mean, if you push it in really hard, then you oh, you get a yeah. Uh, oh yuck! Oh no, Tess, what have you done? That is all over my face. Oh no! Oh no! That's so fucking uneven! Oh, this is the worst! Fuck it, that'll do. Alright, let's move on. That brown colour. Trash! Now I'm going to take my blending brush and go back into burnt orange and just buff over all of that. And we... Right. Blending brush. Burnt orange. Uh... It's an attempt. And then we go back in and we blend it all out. Okay, GG. I think the orange colours have been the most successful colours so far. That brown though. Jesus, take the wheel! Right, whatever. I'm taking a little bobby brown eyeshadow brush and I'm going back in with cypress umber and I'm just going to really darken and smoke out this lash line. And oh, bitch, please, no, no more cypress umber. Really fucking squelch it on there good, dude. Oh, f oh, oh, oh. And somehow it's ended up all the way out there. Dude. Okay, attempt, I attempted it. All 
all the way into here. Oh, oh, I'm just oh, gonna really darken that crease. That's and awful. I'm gonna take my blending brush and I'm gonna dip into red ochre and I'm just gonna blend that brown out a little bit. Okay. So there's red ochre, which is this little friend there. And now we, so blending brush. Oh, hello. Okay. This fluffy friend. And then we just go over it again. How high do you think Jeffree Star was in this video? Because he is having the best time. It's just like, go with another color. Blend it out. Go with another color. Blend it out. I wholeheartedly approve. This colour is much better. I don't know what the fuck was up with that brown. But that was not a good time. We've done a terrible job of all of this. I don't care. Alright. Now I'm going to take temper out one more time. And we're just going to use that light shade to add some highlight. And really get these smoky eyes flawless. Flawless smoky eyes. Sure! Yeah, I've got, right, tempura. Egg tempura. I should have gone even higher up. I've got, I, there's quite a lot of real estate in this sort of situation here. Could I go even higher up? Fuck it, why not? Let's grab that and then go do this the last step, that red ochre bullshit. That's so much more fun. Ma! See that red colour? Look, it's fine. Sure. Right. Tempura to make this smoky eyes flawless. Now it's time to smoke out the lower lash line. Let's now, the love letter and the Venetian red are so pretty. Usually I would never put this under my eye, but I think it's rage. time. So we're going to take this little guy and we're just going to start by pressing the pencil brush right on that highlight and then dragging away. Okay. Ooh, girl. Okay, we're gonna grab a little pencil brush, friend. Uh, this appears to be a. That's a sponge. Oh, it looks like what he's using. Okay. And so we're going in with the little. Whatever this red friend down here is. It's, she's pink. And then. Oh. Okay. I'm starting here. Oh, that's okay. That's not as pointy as I thought. Your brush choice was a choice, mate. And, and it's on my nose. Oh, I thought I was being careful. I was not. Oh, he's done a beautiful job of blending that. Right. And voila. Now, to make that inner corner really... Pop right. Voila. No, I hate this. Let's use something a little bit more appropriate, please. Oh, that's gone in my eye. Bitches flicked everywhere, fuck. I look sad. I'm gonna be wetting my brush. Oh, good. And I'm gonna spray the brush until it's soaking wet. And I'm gonna go Ooh, back in with soaking Prima wet. Vera. So I'm just gonna take it in my inner corner. Okay, so now we're going to grab, where's that little brush that I was using for this shit, right? We are going to go in and make it soaking wet. Oh. Whoa. And uh, in a corner. Oh, no. Oh, no, that's the shit on your nose. No. Get off. I think that's the best we're gonna get. Yeah. Okay. Right. And just 
put it right over that burgundy color. Wow. For the waterline, we definitely need a nude or a white liner. I think I'm gonna do nude again. I've just been such a fan of this, and when I really like something, I gotta do it over and over. So this is Honey Dude Liner from ColourPop, and I'm just gonna pop this in the waterline. And okay. Nude. Waterline. Let's go. Why would you even bother? Get the waterlines already nude. Stupid. Hang on. Big Daddy J knows best! Alright, oh, okay, I see, because my waterline at the moment is full of fucking pink powder. Oh dear. Yeah, that's mostly pink. Oh. I don't think that's. I don't. Oh. I think I'm just gonna blend it out and just keep it really dark because I'm loving how dark it is on my upper, on these uppers. Oh, I, oh it's dark for you, is it, mate? Yeah, you know, I wish, I wish my face was dark too. Okay, Eureka, calm down. I, I don't have benefit mascara. <laughs> I got the chicken here in the supermarket. It's this colossal volume. The colossal volume. Oh, and then do I have to put on false lashes? Fuck's sake. Oh, oh god, help. Oh god! Friends, if you could be a little less clumpy, that'd be fun. Cheers. Look how gorgeous and big these are. Woo, you lord. These are so big, they're about to slap my eyebrows, and I'm kind of obsessed with it. Usually I would do lighter, but today I'm just going to be lighter free, and I am I'm loving it. So I think it's time to put on some lips. I'm going to be going in with Max. Okay. <sighs> Jeffrey says lashes. Fuck. Guess I gotta go. <sighs> do lashes. Right. So apparently we had to do fake lashes. So today we're gonna go on with this very grubby old pair of Glam by Manicare in the style Taylor. Ultra fine for a discreet natural looking finish. Oh fuck. I, that's not the. F no. Okay. Well, whatever. And I'm gonna use the squatty old tight. Oh fuck. Lash glue. Oh, these are, these are oh, natural. All right, whatever. Absolutely. There's a piece of sawdust stuck in this one. What the fuck have I been up to? Yikes. Oh, this is, oh, this is a struggle. Okay. Right. Eyelashes. <sighs> Super underwhelming. No, I think there's a lip situation. What I'm just going to do is go in real quick and chuck on something. All right, all right. Okay, so there's my finished look. Got a pink lip thing happening. Jeffrey thought blonde hair was a go and yeah, this is the closest shirt I could find. So, conclusions. I don't know what I can say about this. I mean, if you go to your shop, you find a full palette for ten dollars local currency, and you buy it. You you can't expect magic. You can't expect miracles. Some of the colours were workable. Some of these little orangey moments, like that guy was, you know, the orange. Um, the pink ones were okay. The the sparkly ones, however, and that fucking dark brown colour, my god! Yeah, that's, I mean, the things, look how messy and shit everything is now, it's, it's a disaster. Uh, the real one cost $85, New Zealand dollars. This was 10 and I think it's about an eighth of the quality. Was it fun to use? No, it wasn't fun to use. 
Did we achieve a lock? Yeah, I mean, we got there in the end, but my God, the, my camera had a fresh battery and completely ran out. It took such a long time. Should you save up and get the real thing? Probably, yeah. If you just want to get a shit pallet, fuck around, see what you can do. Uh, sure. Yeah, I mean, there were, you know, some of the neutral orangey colours were quite good. They blended okay. But the fallout, my, uh, it was all, all in and around. You, you put some on the brush, you go tap, tap, phew. It was okay. It was okay. Uh, W7 Delicious, uh, I can't recommend. <laughs> Cannot, cannot recommend. Uh, taffy not approved. I still look cute though, but that's because I am cute. I'm fucking adorable. Now I'm going to go think about my life choices and, you know, dream of being able to afford real makeup. Yay me! Uh, Alright. Taffy out, kids. Mwah. Love ya. <laughs>